Good morning. I'm going to show you the problems in my life. I'm really pissed off. This is my pissed off face. I'm really pissed off because uh, I wrecked the boat. <clears throat> Took it out the other day. And we put it in the lake in a different, uh, a different boat launch and uh, seemed to work really good. And then we kind of went through the bay a little bit, turned around, went out into the open lake and spot I've never been in before and went around a bit of a corner, uh, not anywhere close to shore at all and uh, gave it some throttle and the back of the boat went down a little bit as it was uh, starting to leave and what the hell backed off the throttle hitting rocks nothing nothing marked it went open water hitting rocks uh, so I destroyed the prop on the back of the boat I'll show you this Hitting rocks. Look at that. Isn't that nuts? Man, oh man. Look at this one. Half gone. And really smushed up the, uh, the bottom supposed to be, the bottom of the drive supposed to be like that. So, um, very very angry with the whole situation um, I mean there's nothing I could really have done different I don't think I didn't know I haven't been on that part of the lake before nothing was marked there was the worst possible spot for me to throttle up and have the bottom of the boat dig to start going um, geez man so, uh, whatever, I gotta get over, get over that part. Anyway, I watched a couple of videos on how to take this uh, propeller off. Um, so I'm gonna do that inch and a sixteenth socket, pry these lock tabs up, um, block of wood in here to stop the propeller from turning and take the nut off. There's some isolator bits on the inside. The whole thing should come off. Hopefully I can get another propeller and it's not going to be too much. Uh, not going to be hundreds of thousands of dollars. And then um, put it back together again. I'm really hoping that the shaft isn't bent or something. Um, she might have a little wobble to her. I'm not sure. Anyway, uh, I'll try it with a new propeller. Uh, this all goes back together again. The lock nut gets torqued to 55 foot pounds. And then I'm going to try my best to uh, recontour this just a little bit without taking off any more material and see how it runs. Because uh, what you going to do? Anyway, sad news. I wrecked the boat. Once again, my pissed off face. And I guess I'm over it. So, okay, I'm gonna get some tools and uh, take that thing apart and see if I can find, uh, find some parts. Thanks for watching.